For over 50 years, humans have been exploring the surface of Mars. According to the United Nations Office for Outer Space Affairs, nations have sent 18 human-made objects to Mars over 14 separate missions. Many of these missions are still ongoing, but over the decades of Martian exploration, humankind has left behind numerous pieces of debris on the planet's surface. In mid-August 2022, NASA confirmed that the Mars rover Perseverance had spotted a piece of trash jettisoned during its landing, this time a tangled mess of netting. This isn't the first instance of trash being found on Mars. There's quite a bit of debris on the planet. So where does all this debris come from? Debris on Mars primarily comes from three sources, discarded hardware, inactive spacecraft, and crashed spacecraft. Every mission to the Martian surface requires a protective module for the spacecraft. This module includes a heat shield for atmospheric entry and a parachute and landing hardware for a soft landing. As spacecraft descend, they eject parts of this module, which land in different locations on the planet's surface. For example, a heat shield may land in one place and a parachute in another. Upon impact, this debris can break into smaller pieces as happened during the Perseverance rover's landing in 2021. Martian winds can then scatter these small pieces across the surface. Over the years, various small, wind-blown pieces of trash have been discovered. For instance, on June 13, 2022, the Perseverance rover spotted a large, shiny thermal blanket wedged in rocks 1.25 miles 2 kilometers, from its landing site. Both Curiosity in 2012 and Opportunity in 2005 also encountered debris from their landing vehicles. More recently, the Perseverance rover discovered a piece of netting on July 12, 2022, more than a year after landing on Mars. Inactive spacecraft. Moving on, let's talk about inactive spacecraft. Nine inactive spacecraft on Mars contribute to the debris on its surface. These spacecraft include the Mars 3 lander, Mars 6 lander, Viking 1 lander, Viking 2 lander, Sojourner rover, the formerly lost Beagle 2 lander, Phoenix lander, Spirit rover, and the most recently deceased Opportunity rover. While mostly intact, these crafts are more like historical relics than trash. Wear and tear. In addition to these larger pieces, wear and tear also contribute to the debris. Parts of Curiosity's aluminum wheels have broken off and are scattered along the rover's path. Some litter is deliberate, like when Perseverance dropped the drill bit onto the surface in July 2021 to swap in a new pristine bit for collecting samples. Crashed spacecraft. Besides wear and tear, crashed spacecraft and their fragments are another significant source of trash. At least two spacecraft have crashed, and four others lost contact before or just after landing. Safely descending to Mars is one of the most challenging aspects of any landing mission, and it doesn't always succeed. So, just how much debris is there? Adding up the mass of all spacecraft sent to Mars gives about 22,000 pounds, 9,979 kilograms. Subtracting the weight of currently operational craft on the surface, 6,306 pounds, 2,860 kilograms leaves 15,694 pounds, 7,119 kilograms of human debris on Mars. Now, why does this trash matter? Today, scientists' main concern about trash on Mars is the risk it poses to current and future missions. The Perseverance teams document all debris they find, ensuring none of it contaminates the samples the rover is collecting. NASA engineers have also evaluated whether Perseverance could get tangled in trash from the landing and concluded the risk is low. Beyond the practical concerns, the real reason debris on Mars is important is because of its place in history. The spacecraft and their pieces are the early milestones for human planetary exploration. This brings us to the end of our Martian exploration. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed this video and want to stay updated on our latest content, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to ring the bell icon to receive notifications about our new videos. See you next time.